Good morning everyone and welcome to the Trade Talk podcast. This is Shrikant Chauhan from Kotak Securities PCG Research. In the US, equity markets recovered from the initial losses as Federal Reserve Chair Mr. Powell softened his tone during a second day of testimony, saying policymakers will wait for fresh jobs and inflation data before deciding how much to raise interest rate later this month. So, in the coming mid, they may increase interest rates by 25 basis points or by 50 or even 75 basis points. So, it depends upon the data. So, again now we have to keep a close watch on the macros like 10 year bond yield and as well as um, the dollar index so if we see furthermore improvement i mean to say upward activity in this macros then it will have impact on the emerging markets but um, on wednesday the data was at an unchanged levels 10 year bond yield was around 3.97 and the dollar index was around 105.65 so we are going to see neutral sort of activity in today's date uh, after opening higher somewhere close to 17,000, 70, 17,800 maybe, uh, we, we are expecting market to come down to the uh, support level of 17,700 where the market is having huge amount of put writing. Uh, below 17,700 we can expect further more weakness towards 17,600 or even 550. But uh, around 17,800 the market is having huge amount of uh, call writing as well as resistance in terms of retracement ratios so we need to be careful around 17,800 there in fact we should look for taking some profit on long positions for the bank nifty as we discussed 41,850 going to act as resistance support is around 41,250 200 levels and apart from uh, BFSI we are also going to focus on a few metal companies especially steel companies there we are expecting upward activity and a few capital goods and uh, engineering stocks should do well so broadly we are of the view that we should be uh, focused more on the levels uh, for the day and um, because it's a weekly expiry day uh, we need to uh, keep a close watch on those levels where there is huge amount of call and put writing like 17,700 and 17,800 above 17,800 the market would uh, move towards 17,900 levels that's all from my side with this i'm ending today's morning podcast thank you very much for listening us have a great day to all of you